it's growing really well at Trevor College. The instructors are kind of goofy and they're really they're really into like being with the students. The classes are very small. They're about like 13 students is how big my class is. So you get a lot of help from the instructors. They're really adamant on emailing you back if you have any questions to, from them about your coursework and stuff like that and the online stuff. So it's really, it's pretty easy to do everything that they have here for you. What I did before Charter College is I worked at GameStop for a while and then I, before that I was going to CBC and I found out that you had to be a dental assistant for quite a while before being accepted into the dental hygiene program so I had to look around a little bit and I was pregnant before that so I kind of needed something that would work around my schedule for a while so I found Charter College and they have like the 10 month program and that was something that would work for me. In my spare time, I, I used to spin poi, which is kind of like spinning fire, like they did in Hawaii. And then, um, ap like before that though, I used to ride horses, and I used to do all, I used to do all kinds of stuff. And I I draw it a lot because I did a tattooing apprenticeship for a while. So I I've lived around several places. I used to move a lot. I've lived in Hawaii. I've lived in Idaho. And then I got pregnant, so then I couldn't do a lot of that stuff anymore. So now I'm just kind of a homebody. <laughs> My goals after I graduate from Charter College is to find work, obviously. <laughs> um, and then eventually I might, depending on money and how things go, because the economy could fluctuate, um, I might go into school again to do dental hygiene, or I might just continue working as a dental assistant. I chose dental assisting because my sister, my older sister, is a dental hygienist and another reason was because I take really well to like scientific learning type stuff and not, I'm not huge on like a lot of math and I'm not really big on the reading and writing type stuff so I figured that dental assisting would be something that would be easy and I'm a lot more of a hands-on type learner and that's something that I really like to do. What's motivating me to be successful is my my family is motivating me. Um, my month old daughter, she's a big motivation for me. As soon as I got pregnant, it was one of those big things like, oh my gosh, I need to find some larger income for myself so I can support myself and her. And my fiance is a big motivator for me too. He was he went and spent months out in Job Corps about the same amount of time I'd spend here just to be successful and try to make some money and I felt like I could do the same thing. So it was kind of an inspiration for me.